Fruit Tree has returned to the delight of absolutely everybody. You can see here I have 95 of these spirit fruit pulls saved up. Where did I get 95 of them? Well, I got them from my daily tasks and I already claimed them so I can't prove it, but they do drop in the daily tasks. Um, I believe you get five or 10 a day. Um, and then there is an extra uh, brush as well for the cubicle event that drops. So in your daily events, for completing your daily prizes, these lotuses up here will contain parts for the Spirit Fruit Tree event. Um, remember the last time this came out? I think the first time I'll just hit poke. And she, Yan Air comes and pokes the tree, and if she gets nothing, she cries, and you get five green lights. If you poke the tree and she drops a Spirit Fruit, she will, uh, she will have a happy face and the MC will cry. Let's see if I can actually get her to do it, though. Wow, four pulls and no spirit fruits, but I am getting these green um, green items, and you see my tasks has finished here. So um, you have a series of rounds for both tasks and for um, exchange. Let's start with the tasks. Um, if you poke the tree a certain amount of times, you will get more pokes. So you can see in round one, you get a total of one, two, three, four, five, six pokes. In round two, you get two, four, six, uh, plus six, so 12 pokes in round two. And round three, you get uh, five, nine, 13, 17, 18, 19, 20. Yeah, 20 pokes for round three. But in order to collect those extra 20 pokes, you do need to pull a total of 800 times. Since this event has proven to be recurring, you actually could just save up all of your pokes until one of these drops and you have 800 of them. That would work. You would be able to fully complete the entire thing because every day you have a chance of buying 15 more pokes. So, oh, I'm gonna have to pause and do some math, but. Okay, so last time this event came around, we got 165 free pokes um, in the event from the task shop and from the dailies. There was 105 available in the store for 3,150 gold for a total of 270 pokes. We should expect the same amount this time. Um, and then we will also get 95 more from the dailies, or well, I started with 95 from the last time that we played this event, so we're looking at a total of 365. Now let me just add in what we'll get each day from the, um, from the dailies. And then 21 more from the daily pulls of this event. So we should be looking at around 386 to 400 pulls, um, depending on how many you had saved up from the last time. I had a little bit of extra from not spending my pokes when I should have, so some of you might have more saved up from last time, some of us might have less saved up from last time. At the end of the day, um, we are looking at around 380 pulls. This is a really, really awesome event because you can see here you can get spirit fruits for really cheap and they get cheaper with each event that you, um, which each round of the shop that you um, unlock. So round one, they're 40, round two, they're 38, round three, they're 36, and round four, they are only 32. Um, there's also more items that you can purchase like scrolls and peacock jades as well as elite papers Five star pith is going to be really useful for any whales who are doing um, yin yang teams and There's even cheap fate stones available in here oh, We're looking at about 300 pulls over the course of the spirit fruit tree event this round. It could be more next round. It could be um, less uh don't forget to use your pokes. They are super useful. Definitely use those. Definitely collect everything in here. Um, and make sure to increase the power of your mounts. That's it. That's all we got this week. So I will catch you all in the next one. Bye bye.